Friction is a force that plays an important role in our everyday lives. It's the reason we can walk without slipping, the force that allows cars to grip the road, and even the reason we can write with a pencil. At its core, friction occurs when two surfaces come into contact and resist each other's motion. There are two main types, static friction, which keeps objects at rest from moving, and kinetic friction, which acts on moving objects. Static friction is usually stronger, which is why it takes more effort to start moving a heavy box than to keep it sliding. The amount of friction depends on the materials in contact and how rough or smooth their surfaces are. For instance, rubber on asphalt provides a lot of grip, which is why we rely on it for tires. On the other hand, ice on metal creates very little friction, making it slippery and dangerous. Interestingly, friction also generates heat. When you rub your hands together, the friction between your skin creates warmth. This is why we can start a fire by striking a match or rubbing sticks together. Understanding friction not only helps us in daily tasks, but also in engineering and design, where controlling this force is essential for safety and efficiency. So next time you walk, drive, or even write, remember the invisible force of friction working hard behind the scenes.